Hey guys, it's your girl Tower Crush back with another review and this time it is for sisters on BET and if you haven't already hit my subscribe button if you are a regular watcher I know I owe y'all a have and a have nots video and I will do that one later tonight but I really enjoyed the sisters episode and so I'm gonna go ahead and do that one because y'all be liking those a little bit better than the have and the have nots. But I am gonna get it in. I'm gonna get it in. Y'all just give me, be patient. Y'all know, if you didn't know, I lost my husband on Saturday. And it's a lot. So I'm doing my best to um, keep it together. These videos actually give me an outlet to not think about stuff. So never be concerned with me doing videos because that's just my outlet. To not have to think about everything that I have to think about right now, which is a lot of stuff. I'm sure you can, I'm sure you understand. Okay, so let's get into this episode. Um, okay, so Gary must have, okay, he said he changed the bullets to rubber bullets. Okay, so why didn't you get the up and help Andy? When your wife was berating her and scaring her to death. With a gun that you knew didn't have any ammo in it. Because it hurt? Are you serious? But you want us to believe that you really love this woman? She was scared to death. What if she had a heart attack and died right there? What if that had happened? Then what? Then what, Gary? What was you going to do? And, and, and she's dead to... Like, Andy, I don't... I don't think he has a dumber character. Like... She says, now we know where your key is. Okay. He said that he lost his keys in the apartment some, in his hotel room. And he thinks that the hotel uh, cleaners took it. So how was she in this hotel room if they ain't messing around? How did she have access to his keys if they ain't messing around? Somebody please tell me. Like she's dense as I don't know what, like. And his son is at her mom's and he's taking him to his mom's. No, when we going to see this little boy? When are you going to be a father, Gary? You just a whole deadbeat chasing after this dumb lawyer. For what? What's the real plot with you and with Gary and, and his, yeah, Jasmine? Something ain't clean in that milk. Something more's going on. Remember Jasmine told her before they beat her up that he bought her another ring and it was a bigger ring. Um... What happened to that ring? Why are you still worried about him buying her ring? Come on with the right and get it together, Tyler, because this is not making no sense. And it really, really made me mad. It really, really made me mad. Okay, moving right along. Aaron and Karen. Gross. Uh, the scene was way too long. I don't care about them. Um, he was just way too dramatic. I just wanted to show you I could be better than him. And No, shut up. You could have been show her that. You was trying to torture her by not giving her sex. Even though you was willing to give her sex that one night in the hotel, you back to being Christian and, 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 and a pastor and you can't do it. Really? Now you need some time apart for what? Y'all wasn't even, uh, y'all wasn't even together. Y'all, <laughs> y'all being apart, which was the whole problem. <laughs> Seriously. Is, is you, is you the, you know, that's what she ought to just say to him. Like, what, what we doing here? I wouldn't have to get it elsewhere as if I was getting it here. I don't need to think about it. I know that's why I got some. So that scene was way too long and it was very unnecessary. Danny and Preston was kind of cute. I liked it. Um, I didn't like the part where uh, Sabrina felt like, you know, when she walked in and, and he was like, she's hiding somewhere. Why, why you, why she gotta be hiding? Like, I just, that's the only thing I really don't like about Danny's character. She don't really be respecting her friends and she don't respect no black man. She be so nasty to black men, period. Like, it don't matter what black man it is, she got an attitude with him. I really wish she would do something about that, Tyler, please. Um, but Sabrina and her, uh. And, and her being nervous around Jacoby. Girl, please. You should have uh, let him finish hunching. You should have finished hunching him. Why are you nervous now? You weren't nervous when you put him out. You weren't nervous when you put him out because you thought Calvin was coming over. Calvin with the panties. With the easy access panties. You wasn't nervous then. Don't be nervous now. Sabrina, she just irks my nerves. She, she really does. 
And then uh, I want to talk about Calvin's checks. That was that was a kind of a weird situation, don't you think? His account is being em his account is being emptied, and he don't even know about it. Like, how was dude able? Why would he even come into a bank where he knew? Uh, uh. He should have walked out when he saw his roommate standing right there. Like, he's not going to know. That whole scene was just messy, Tyler. I don't know what type of... I don't know where you're going with that storyline, but it's messy. It's kind of thrown together, just like you threw together um, Maurice's ex coming and actually being the one having sex with old boy in that room. You just threw it together, and I don't like it. I'm just letting you know I don't like it. It was lazy, and I don't like it. But we're going to see where it's going to go, because... Calvin, I guess, is going to find out next week that his account has been hacked. And he's got to go through Sabrina to get his money back. How convenient. Okay, and, and let me talk about Gary asking uh, Andy to model. No, before I ask about, before I talk about that, let's talk about Andy trying to uh, confront uh, Fatima. What makes you think that she would lie to you and tell you that she did know that that was his ex? Didn't know it was his ex. Like, why was why would she lie? And why would she want to be involved with her boss's best friend's ex-boyfriend? She's not that kind of woman. And I don't like the fact that Fatima told her to tell um to tell Karen that it was over. No, it's not. It's not over. Nope. Y'all giving me another, y'all gonna give me another bathroom scene. It is not over. It's not over. <laughs> Don't be telling that lad to just be trying to, mm -mm. cause if she try to fire you, somebody else will pick you up because they see how how boss and how clutch you are. And plus, she probably not that far from getting your own law degree, honey. So, uh, Fatima, I really don't like you bowing down to Andy. She ain't nobody, and you really didn't need to let your man go. What you needed to do was have a conversation with him and tell him the next time something bothering you, don't lie to me. Tell me what it is so that we can talk through it. Don't take away my option. You don't know if I would have left you alone for messing with your ex because I know things happen, but I will leave you alone for lying to me and then trying to make me feel like I'm crazy when I asked you about it. Not even going to work. So back to Gary and his crazy self. So he want Andy to model. I don't even trust it. I don't trust it at all. It's something to it. He going to ask her to model uh, for his friend, but then going to ask Okay, so if it's a modeling for his friend, where's the photo shoot? Is it going to be at her house or is it going to be at an actual location? Because I would think if he's an actual photographer, it should be at a location. Well, it may be, but I just feel like it's going to be like a pop-up wedding or something. Like, he's going to try to do something really, really crazy. And um, and Andy probably going to fall for it. And they probably not. And uh, yeah, because I remember seeing the previews. Her being in some type of wedding dress or at a wedding shop talking about, I'll be here alone. Yeah, you need to be alone because you're making this decision alone. Because I, as your friend, I cannot stand next to you while you marry this clown. And we still don't know who the white woman is that they was taking pictures of with him. I ain't forget. I ain't forget. He got too much going on. And she don't know none of them answers. And she's supposed to be somebody's attorney. She could never work for me. I could talk circus around her. I'm not saying the real woman. I'm talking about Andy, the character. I will talk circles around her. She could be my attorney. Oh, no. So I definitely do not trust uh, Gary at all. Um, I don't trust Jasmine. Um, I don't like she she should have definitely smacked him when she realized that he wasn't really shot because he let her sit there and be tormented by Jasmine. And that was just wrong. Like, I just, this is something with them that's just not right. It, it, mm. We're going to figure out what it is, though. But I don't think Andy could ever be considered to be smart. I don't think she'd be smart enough to catch on to it if it, if it was right in her face. Because Andy's just kind of slow like that. But I'm going to get up off of it because it, it upsets me. But that is my $5.02. Again, if you have not, please hit the subscribe button right down there or right up. <laughs> wherever it may be just hit it for me if not hit the like button if you liked it if you didn't like it hit the unlike button if not thank you for watching anyway i appreciate you and that's it peace